Hello and welcome to this week's Angel Oracle card reading for week commencing the 26th of February 2024. My name is Ray and I'm a guide who helps you remember your divine presence so that you can heal your past, create your future and transform your present. To raise your consciousness, remember why you are here, the steps you need to take to come out of that spiritual closet so you can fulfill your purpose in this lifetime. Spread your wings and soar to take charge of your destiny. Now this week we're going to be using Carl Gray's Gateway of Light activation cards. But as always before we get into this week's card reading, I would like to say thank you so, so much for your continued support. It really does mean a lot to me to be able to be a service to you and for you to trust me enough to use my services. So thank you so much um, for that and for following, subscribing, liking, comment. Everything you do to support me really helps me raise my vibration so that I can be more of service to you and help raise you um, with your vibration and learning. Now, don't forget, um, with that in mind, on the, uh, what date are we doing? See, my memory's gone here. On the, uh, in March, <laughs> on the 16th and 17th of March, um, menopause. On the 16th and 17th of March, I'm going to be running an Angelic Reiki 1 and 2 workshop in Dartford. There are still a couple of spaces left if you would like to come and take a chance, you know, to step onto that path of working with the Angelic Kingdom. Maybe you want to take it further and go and do three and four, become a practitioner um, to, you know, to practice on, you know, other people publicly. Maybe you want to become a teacher. Or maybe you just want to do one and two just to give you that deep connection, find out a bit more about yourself, your journey, any gifts or talents that you may have. And really that sense of community of being with other like-minded people. So, as always, I will give the cars a quick cleanse and a bless. So, what does everyone who's watching this need to know for their highest good? The week commenced on the 26th of February 2024. What does everyone who's watching this need to know for their highest good? The week commenced in oh, the 26th of February 2024. Okay, so the cards are going to make me work for them this week. Okay, so the cards we've got to come out are. Holy Grail, inner discovery, finding sacredness, you are what you seek. Emerald Tablet Activation, Cosmic Ordering, Divine Alchemy, Conscious Manifesting. And Sword of Light, Divine Protection, Cords Cut, Breakthrough Energy. Okay, so what the stories, what the story, what the cards are saying this week, the story of the cards this week, is that whatever you are seeking is internal, it is within you. Um, you know, we often seek outside pleasures, ideas, inspiration, um, guidance, which is absolutely great. But occasionally we have to take a step back and look within ourselves. You know, we have the inner knowledge, the inner guidance. You know, we are our own holy grail. Um, so this week, you know, take the time to go within. What is it I seek? What is it I really want in life? How do I want to show up in life? And ask those questions this week whilst you're in meditation. And know that the answers you receive, whether internally or when you turn on the TV or read a book or something like that or see a billboard, although they're external, they've come from you asking inwardly um, for the universe to give you those answers because you may not um, accept or believe the answers that you get internally. So. When you actually go within and you seek the answers yourself, you don't always get them within yourself. They can come from outside, um, but you need to ask those questions first. So it's very important this week to sit down and ask those questions. Why am I here? What am I seeking? What do I want to achieve? What do I want to do? Where do I want to go? 
And then by doing that, you're actually um, manifesting you know, these things into your life. You're actually connecting to the universe, to the cosmos and saying, okay, these are the questions I want the answers to. And the universe, the cosmos will give you those answers, but also not just give you the answers, but actually the steps to take them, even bring them into you. So be open to what answers you receive, what you manifest into your life, because every question is a manifestation and can be a manifestation that brings the answers, the results of those questions to you. And know that you are fully protected um, this week. You know, when you sit in that space, when you ask those questions, trust and know the divine guidance you're going to be given is the correct guidance for you. You know, and if you feel that there's any cords that need to be cut that's still keeping you tied to anything um, that you're, that's holding you back from seeking and finding what you need, then cut those cords. You know, it's, it's really straightforward. You just close your eyes, call an Archangel Michael and ask him, please, or, um, or thank you for cutting any ties, cords that connect me to anything that's holding me back from seeking my truth, finding my purpose. And then see, fully imagine or know him cutting the cords above your head, below your feet, to your left, to your right, to your front, to your back, to the sides. And just know that they are being, they are being cut um, for you. And as soon as the sword cuts through, they're automatically cauterized so they can't come back. And by doing this, as well as going in and seeking, there will be breakthroughs. You will get the guidance you need. You will see where you are going, what you are supposed to be doing, how you're meant to um, go there. So yeah, that's really all the cards are giving me this week. It's, a very, it's very personal this week in the cards. Um, so not a lot are, um, of outside uh, influences or stuff going on. This is very much internal this week. But of course, this is my interpretation of the cards. And when you look at them, you may go, actually, I get a different interpretation and that is absolutely fine. I draw these cards for what you need to know for your highest good. And this is just the interpretation that I get guided to give you. So the cards again are Holy Grail, Inner Discovery, Finding Sacredness. You are what you seek. Emerald Tablet Activation. Cosmic ordering, divine alchemy, conscious manifesting. Sword of light, divine protection, cords cut, breakthrough energy. And if you notice, you know, you've got kind of like two swords there this week. Which means breakthroughs, cutting healing is all coming in for you this week you just have to sit with it so please do let me know in the comments whether these cards resonated you got your own interpretation um you know i always love to read the comments and reply to anyone who comments or messages me direct um and don't forget to um, check out the angelic Reiki one and two workshop and if you want to do the other workshops as well then there is a discount available for um, pre-booking more than one um, in advance. It is absolutely the most amazing thing. My life really changed um, when I did Angelic Reiki, you know, and there's lots of interviews of me um, out there that you can check out where I've been guests on other people's show where I've shared um, parts of my story um, with that. And of course, don't forget to check out my show, Angels and Destiny, which if you're watching this on Sunday, is taking place tomorrow, Monday. If you're watching this Monday, it's taking place 8 p.m. UK time. And if you're watching later in the week, um, it, uh, watch the replay. I've got the beautiful um, Stephanie uh, Zito back on the show. She's been on my show a couple of times and I really love chatting to her. And she's back this Monday. So um, do come and join us if you can. And have a wonderful week. Take care. Bye.